Hi, this is Cindy, and today we're going to be making some spaghetti and with alfredo sauce and chicken and some seafood mix. I have some mussels here that has been washed. I have some without the shell. And I have some shrimp here. So what do we need for this? I have some black pepper. I'm using some chicken, maggie chicken mix for the chicken and some garlic. So we're going to see, I have my chicken seasoned up here. All it has is uh, the chicken mix, the black pepper, and the garlic. I didn't add any salt because the Maggie mix has salt in it already. I have here some freshly chopped parsley, some fresh garlic, and some green seasoning. So let's put this together. So I have some avocado oil heating here in a pan. The first thing I'm going to do is grill my chicken. It's not going to take very long because it's very thinly sliced. So you're going to cook it for a couple minutes on both sides. So my chicken is finished, so you're going to just set this aside for a moment. So I have a pot here with boiling water that has been salted. I'm going to add my spaghetti to this and I'll allow it to completely cook. So I have my spaghetti here that's already boiled. So we're going to put this together and fry it up with some veggies. So I have here some chopped mushrooms, some colored pepper, some orange, some green, some red. You can use whatever veggies you have or whatever you like. I have here some chopped fresh parsley and some garlic. We're going to need a little bit of oil. You can use avocado, olive oil or whatever you have at home. Some black pepper and a little piece of butter. So let's put this together. So once my pot is heated, I just added some of the oil, some of my fresh green season and some garlic. We're going to allow this to fry like a minute or two. And then we're going to add the mushrooms and the chopped peppers. So to this I just added a little sprinkle of black pepper. Totally optional. So you're going to give this a good mix. And allow this to completely cook out. Then we're going to add a, a little bit of butter to this and we're going to add the pasta. So the last step before we add the pasta. I just added a little piece of butter in there and now I added my salt because if you had added before your vegetables would reduce too much of liquid release too much of liquid sorry see that let it cook up in the butter for like a minute or two and then it's ready for your pasta all right let me down here we're going to watch there you have yeah now I have my mushrooms and peppers my spaghetti mushroom and peppers so this is finished i'm gonna plate it with my seafood mix and i'm gonna show you guys how it turns out so now i'm gonna finish off the seafood mix and for this we need some garlic some fresh parsley some seafood mix a piece of butter some black pepper salt and for my seafood i'm using baby shrimps some mussels on in the shell and I bought some without the shell so you're gonna put your hot pot up to heat with a little bit of oil so once your oil is heated I just add my fresh garlic and fresh chopped parsley you're gonna allow this to fry for a minute or two and then you're gonna add a piece of butter to this okay. allow that to cook in there and melt completely so I just added my shrimp. I'm adding some seafood mix. I think I'm gonna have that a little more. So I'm gonna add some salt, some black pepper. And you're gonna allow this to cook for a few minutes, then we're gonna add the mussels. So once your shrimp has firmed up, you're gonna add your mussels to this and allow this to cook for a bit. So this is pretty much finished. I'm going to dish this off and you guys are going to see what it looks like. Hope you guys try this one. Thank you. And there you have my spaghetti with vegetables, seafood mix, and my grilled chicken. Serve with white sauce. Hope you guys try this one and enjoy it. You guys have a wonderful, blessed day. Thank you.